Hello everybody, welcome back to another great episode here at The Noble Way. We are launching our brand new series and we are calling this Hot or Not. And it sounds really saucy, but it's really just, we're going around the, we're going around the whole Orlando area, different theme parks, restaurants, anywhere we can find that has hot, hot foods or claims to have hot foods. I love it. And we are going to sample them and we're going to find, are they hot? If you're looking for hot stuff, we're going to find out, are they hot or not? And I will tell you, this is the perfect marriage of hot or not in so many different ways. <laughs> in so many different ways. But she not only is hot and I'm not, but she likes hot things and I, I like don't like hot stuff. <laughs> but actually, I like the flavor of hot stuff. I just can't take it. Man, am I a wimp. Like, it's like literally like a barbecue potato chip sends me running to get some water. I'm not kidding. Our first victim on the agenda is going to be the amazing Nashville hot chicken mac and cheese that is at Universal Mardi Gras that is going on right now. So I am pumped to give it a shot uh, and try out whether or not this is going to be hot or not. We have tried finding hot food at Universal a few times and yeah. they told us it's been hot and then it wasn't. So stay tuned, this episode is gonna be a ton of fun, I hope. Um, hopefully I can still feel my mouth after it. We'll okay. find out. We are in line at the I don't know what it's called, but it's a booth. We're in line for the Nashville hot chicken. Uh, and they actually have another chicken thing too. I don't remember. Chicken biscuit. Chicken biscuit. And I don't know which one we're gonna get, but if we get the Nashville hot chicken, it better be hot. You, I mean, I don't like hot stuff, but so far in the New Orleans Mardi Gras at Universal, everything that's supposed to be hot, has not been hot and I'm a wimp when it comes to hot so um, I think we'll see we it's starting to get a little bit dark out so we're trying to do the best we can with the lighting lighting is always a challenge but we stopped at we finally got our savory items we did so many sweet items so we were dying for like some savory like salty salty never make that face again that's the thumbnail right there guys everyone's gonna be like oh my god he looks terrible so annoying I should be a ventriloquist. Look at it. I can, oh, I can be a ventriloquist. I, I can be a ventriloquist and talk about it. Anyhow, I it. Um, I'm excited because we got the Nashville hot chicken mac and cheese Which for was $12.99. $12.99. Let's check it out. All I know is I was carrying this over to the table and I got it on my, I got the sauce on my finger. I licked it off. I was like, uh, it's really hot. <laughs> so. I mean, there's really not much to say about this. Yeah. It's Nashville hot chicken with mac and cheese and green onions. Now, I will tell you, I've been so disappointed with the level of heat at this festival that I told him, I said, I, I, I said, I really need you to load up the heat. I need you to load the heat up. I said, first I said, I need you to make it like Blake Shelton hot. And then the, the, the lady at the booth was like, you and I have a different de definition of hot. And I said, okay, I need you to make it Bruno Mars hot, and level I was hot. Like, and then she was like, now you're speaking my language. <laughs> Bruno Mars hot. I mean, Bruno Mars is a beautiful man. I ain't gonna lie. Beautiful man. So, this is the Bruno Mars level of hotness chicken. So, forget Nashville hot. The lady making it, she was like drowning it in that sauce. This is the Bruno Mars level of hotness chicken mac and cheese oh and by the way look how adorable she looks in this mask what? i mean she looks so cute i can't even smile even in this, despite the fact like when i smile it comes up to here so that's why i keep, I keep having cuteness things. i'm so surprised i'm actually really yeah. surprised at how few people are dressed up for party I feel like I'm, the oh, I'm pumped let's give it a go um i've got a fork here you yeah, i'll take this fork you take this fork let's give it a go i mean they loaded it up with hot sauce Keep so i know i like it i'm gonna wait Cause I might go running for the hills on how hot this is. It's spicy. 
Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I went too hard. You didn't get any water. No, this is actually very, very, very hot. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It's actually pretty bad. It's, oh really, I messed it up. It has a good flavor, but it's very, very hot. This is like a 20 out of 10 hot. What do you think? I can't think. All the blood's rushing to my mouth. You're gonna have to do the, you do the review. It's too hot. It's too hot. Well, if you've ever had that, that's hot, where the hot stuff is. That's where the hot stuff is. actually hotter. That's where than it is. Hot. Is there anything that doesn't have the sauce on it? Like, I need something. I need a, oh my gosh, I need a drink. I need a water. I actually need a drink too. Why didn't we get a water? Oh my gosh. I'm looking over there. Oh my gosh, why is that, why is that line so long for the pretzel booth? I actually can't eat much more either. It's super, super, super hot. I love the flavor of it. I don't know how he's dealing with it. I'm not. Does it look and like I'm dealing with it? I only had a few it? bites. And I feel like I'm gonna have to waste most of it because it's so hot. Oh my goodness, it's hot. Everything. I don't think you understand. We have. We've been asking for hot stuff since we got here, and nothing's been. Oh, I gotta go. I can take it because he's. I'm sure he's right. My, like my nose is running. It's old. and he's not being dramatic. It's actually very, very hot. And I get hot buffalo wings. I get hot whatever. Woo, it's hot. It's hot. I need Spice some of this biscuit. I need some of this biscuit. But I still like it. I keep eating it because that's How are you still eating that? You're eating that? Oh my gosh. All right. I just keep sucking air in because my mouth is really hot. <laughs> I've recovered. I've, re I've started to recover now. We're about, it's been about 45 minutes since I turned the video off. And I'm starting to recover. So the Nashville hot chicken. Boston, but Boston, ultra like, hot. Literally, if you're on a scale of one to ten, ten's the hottest. This is like a fifty. I challenge you. I'm gonna and challenge. And I love hot stuff. Like I'm not a wuss. Like I really just eat the hottest thing ever. Yeah, she's she's the hottest stuff. This is like extremely hot. So it's like a fifteen. Yeah. Yeah. No. yeah. She likes the hot stuff. I don't know why she's with me because I'm clearly not the hot stuff in any capacity. But. If you are looking for hot food, make sure when you go up there to order this Nashville hot chicken, you tell them you want the Bruno Mars hot chicken. The Bruno Mars hot chicken lit me up. Get the Bruno Mars hot chicken. I made that up. Copyright, patent, noble way. Bruno Mars hot chicken. Apparently he is because this was hot. So anyway, um, but I, overall, even regardless of the hotness, that place rocked. Get everything at that That's booth. The, the the chicken biscuit, the Nashville hot, rocking. Give it a go. Oh my goodness, that was some hot, hot chicken. It definitely was on the hot o meter. I have to say, that was a 10. We're gonna give I it up. A little tally there, one to ten scale. It was a, t it, it was like a, it was like a twenty. It really was. It was very, very hot, but I love the flavor of it, and I want to get it again. <laughs> yeah, I probably shouldn't have told him to crank it up to Bruno Mars hot. <laughs> you probably but, shouldn't have. Yeah, it's so funny because I literally, like, I was like Nashville hot. We want it to be hot, and I thought I don't know Nashville. I was just thinking Nashville. What's what's Nashville? Ooh, I know Blake Shelton. Like Blake Shelton's like a hot a ticket item in Nashville. You know, there's a there's a restaurant down the road called Old Red. It's a Blake Shelton restaurant down the road from us. I was like, I don't know, Blake Shelton, he's hot, right? And the person at the counter was like, yeah, no. And I was like, okay, who else? Uh, ooh, Bruno Mars, he's hot, right? So we went with that. And I gotta tell you, Bruno Mars chicken. This is not sanctioned by Bruno Mars. And just letting you know, he didn't allow us to name it that. That's what we're naming it. Man, it was hot. So anyway, they they double dosed that thing up. So if you're looking for hot, not not. If you're looking for hot, Nashville hot chicken mac and cheese. Get some extra sauce on there. It will light you up. So I'm interested to find out if any of you actually try it and you go there and you think it's hot. Maybe you don't think it's hot. Go back and try it with extra hot sauce and let me know if I'm right or wrong.
Let us know. Let us know if the Bruno Hot Bruno Mars Hot Chicken is in fact a 20 out of 10 because it was hot. So there you have it. Thanks again for joining us. We'll have some more Hot or Not episodes coming up. Lots of other content we've got to check out our other playlists, all of our other content. There's a ton out there. Uh, we appreciate it. Subscribe, like, share, etc. Until tomorrow, the noble way is the easy way. Bye-bye, everybody.